It was, I, I, I don't even know what it was. It was so fast, and, and there was a, uh, there was a hunter, and it was just... Oh, Abby. Here. What? Oh, try drawing. Drawing what? Well, uh, can you draw what attacked you? I also love the on air light, but getting it to Nick, show up with hey, the big light buddy. on Can you tell me what almost those guys impossible. Did you? Gosh, did. He's super out of it. Yeah. The, the, the hunter. Uh, yeah. There was a guy. There was something else. Some kind of animal. Yeah, it was kind weird. of animal. No, no, I only saw a dude trying to take him away. It's probably just disoriented, that's all. The dude was massive and angry. Is Abby? Yeah, hey, she, hey, she's okay, dude. She's right over there. Because teeth were on top of me. It's a bear. Full size bear would have crushed him. There's no way. I thought we were going to get bears right here. Oh, fuck. Look at that. Oh, fuck. shit. That black stuff? That's that's infection. That's And it's it, it's spreading. This is bad. This is really bad, dude. Good start for tonight. Uh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> You're okay. It's okay. Fuck that. We need we medical amputate. attention. We should cut it off before the infection spreads. What? Why would we do that? I don't know, man. Look at that black stuff. What? What do you think it is? Do I look like a doctor? Yeah, this game is cray cray. But based off the black stuff in his leg and the fact that the big fella shot his fingers off as soon as he touched it, I'm going to guess there's some type of zombie. Hey! Got a gun! And I know how to use it! Mm. Sort of. Ryan, what if it's Jacob or Emma? What if it's not? <sighs> Be careful. It was probably nothing. Yeah. But is it gone? That we do not Yeah, know. you better run! I like mead. It's all right, Very mate. Very brave. All right. So, uh... I knew what you meant. Lodge is sounding pretty good right about now, yeah? Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't shoot, don't shoot! I'm here to save you. Holy shit. What the Nick. fuck? Is he okay? Nick and Abby were attacked. In the woods. Hey, does anybody have any dry clothes? I'm, I'm fucking freezing. All our bags are still in the minivan. <sighs> fuck, of course they are. So wait, <laughs> what happened to you? Why right, are right. you naked? Okay, so, like I was saying, okay? I heard Abby screaming, so I came running. Like as fast as I could. From the lake. Yeah, and then and then out of nowhere, I stepped into this like, I don't know, like a like a booby trap, like some sort of hunter's trap. Hunters, I told you it was hunters. The goddamn thing snared my leg, hoisted me halfway into the tree, just zoop. So I'm hanging there, half naked, and then this guy with like a fucking machete comes right up to me, looks me right in the fucking eyes, 
But I taught that guy a lesson, booked it right the fuck out of there. We gotta get Nick and Abby back to the lodge. Like, right now. Uh, hard agree. Also, why are you covered in what I hope is strawberry jelly? Oh, yeah, no, um, I'm pretty sure it's blood. It was this guy with, like, um, he had, like, a bottle thing. I don't know, dude, it's, like, a really long story. Ew. Don't bother clearing that up for anyone. Oh, it's super fucked up. Oh, it, Jesus Christ, I can't believe I haven't told you this yet. I, I saw a fucking body in the lake. Like, a dead one? Oh, no, 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 um... One of the one of the swimmers from the varsity swim team, he got lost on the way to practice. Yeah, he has got boxer yes, shorts. Yes, a so. dead one, dumbass. Of course you did, Jacob. No, for real, I did. I, I figured it must have been one of the counselors that didn't show up, but I couldn't tell because it was like all, all bloaty and gross. Something's not right. I'm only just realizing now something's not right. Not very quick on the uptake this lot. Uh, excuse me. Hey, I need this, okay? It's not safe out there. Dude, we gotta protect Nick and Abby. Yeah, and I need to save Emma, all right? She's out there alone. You don't even know if she's in trouble. You don't even know if you're in trouble. Are you trying to piss me off? No, I'm trying to save my girlfriend's life, asshole. She's yeah, not I don't your think girlfriend, she's your girlfriend, mate. dude. What? Get... Yeah, let go, because otherwise the gun's gonna go off. <laughs> Oh, you lose, Fucking sucker. Stop. We're in a real mess here, guys. You're acting like pricks, both of you. Jacob, we're keeping this. Nick and Abby are injured. We need protection. There's someone around here. <laughs> Ryan! Sorry. This is bullshit. Make sure she's safe. If she's on the island, she's definitely fine. And what, risk another uh, run-in with Captain Deliverance? No thanks, okay? There's probably another boat by the zip line. Either way, I can make it to the island from there. Alright, mate. We also, this dude here. Lodge. Try to get help. Who had the How gun? Nick this fella. Properly. He's in the new Dungeons and Dragons yeah, movie I, I learned idea. today. I saw a picture for it and I was like, oh, that dude's. That dude's one of the dudes in the quarry. Oh, here she is, just still strolling around in her skimpies. Okay, here's a riddle for you. What's got two thumbs and is suddenly riding solo on a freaky island in the dark? This fool, well, one thumb, one available thumb. Okay. And it was here, on a strange, uninhabited island that this brave young soul found herself. I don't know why she's not wearing any clothes. Yeah, that Dungeons and Dragons movie does look good. I've suddenly found myself on a, a strange, tiny little island. I've never played D&D or right know now. anything about so, it, but the film does look fun. There's a treehouse over there. I'm going to go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. Oh, you're off to the creepy, creepy treehouse. Not that I want to go back, because I don't. But even if I did... I can't, because then I'd look like the super needy one when he was the one who, who stormed off in the first place. God, you know what? Sorry, I'm bending. Well, explore <laughs> bending. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do it. To the treehouse, fellow explorers. I won't be doing that, lady. But, okay. Yeah, no. We've all got stuff like that, and we make that we, uh, we buy, and with good intentions... No prizes for guessing what these are. Can't say that I've used them. A little too au naturel for me, TBH. You know, I've never thought about where the waste goes. Oh. Well. Oh, please, God, no. Okay, we're gonna just go ahead and ignore that. You just realise you've been swimming in shit. But now I understand why she doesn't have any clothes, because her clothes are over there.
that you, Jacob? Oh, tarot card. That is why we do the exploring. Because there are clues to be found. So this island is like an unexcavated part of the quarry that rewilded itself after it flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, huh? You know, when I was little, I used to think that islands just kind of would float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser now and realize that not everything's always as it seems. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man child who's all sad because you don't want to go steady with him and write him love letters every freaking day. And while we're talking about it, you don't mind that we're talking about it, right? Why? Why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all blah about it, you know? <sighs> you tell him, girl. Oh, look. A metaphor in the narrative, by mean of fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and... What we reckon, gang? High road or low road? I guess since this isn't live, the choice is up to me. This is live, and the choice is up to you. Ah, oh, what the hell. We're in it now, anyway. Well, and truly in the thick of it. Because you know what else? Well, so really guys, excited. I didn't leave you a chance to uh, life, you know? to pick. I mean, the summer was great, but what's next? I mean, come on. I know by the time I post this, Hackett's Quarry will just be but a distant memory, and I know it's just one night, and you have to make the most of all your opportunities, and yada, yada, yada. I guess I just don't want to have to settle for what's around me, you know? <sighs> Abby sees me as this confident person but really I'm just desperate to stay afloat in a world where everyone wants to be different okay we are we are fully in then I take the high road. This is actually kind of fun. I feel like this is the first time I've been alone all summer. Kind of like it. I guess that kind of reinforces the whole Jacob thing. I know the plan was for him to come get me, but now that I'm by myself, kind of like it. Sorry, Jacob. If you're watching, nothing personal. Her it's feet will be killing and she'll be cool, freezing. Right? Yeah, we're cool. Just saying. I mean, who knows? Maybe in 50 years we'll bump into each other and be flooded with fond memories of that one amazing summer at Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. And that spark that changed our lives forever. Then we'll be like 70 year old lovers or whatever and have crazy walker sex. <laughs> hey, it could happen. Only time will tell, Jakey boy. And as they say, time makes fools of us all. But we will be the oldest, sexiest fools there ever were. <laughs> Until then, I gotta do my thing. Sorry, buddy. I won't lie. This is an extremely boring section. <laughs> it's just waffling into a camera. But there's a fire. Hmm. Thinking about it, how could this have been Mr. H when he was back at the lodge?
quotes. The Raven Nevermore. around see what we can find there's got to be more shears to see we have bare feet on wood and dirt Turns out there was nothing to see. Well, it looks like we're climbing the ladder. I guess I gotta do this one handed, huh? Ayo. That didn't sound great. <laughs> oh shit. I'd literally be putting the phone in my uh, pants or just my bra. You know, I am nailing this ladder climbing. <sighs> oh. Alright. <laughs> this is the luxurious Skyway Treehouse. Obviously. Oh god. Constructed in the year 180 fuck by a blindfolded man who used only the finest rotting wood, rusty nails, and donkey spit that money could buy. A real Hackett vintage classic. Honey, I'm home. Well, What's Lisa's... that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well now, that's a fine how do you do. Aww. Take it all in, folks. That's the summer camp experience right there, and... Oh, look. It seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. I guess one of the kids left their staff... Seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. I guess one of the kids left their staff, or maybe one of the guys back there? But... I don't recognize this. Did you hear that? Looks like they have toys on their hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belongings? Or do we open the spooky trap door and die a horrible, painful death? There are literally no right answers. Oh, I'm going to search the bag. Bag it is. And you know what? I'm putting some clothes on. This is all you're getting. Good. Hello. <laughs> Got a taser, Fine. baby. Okay, so I think there's something up there. And it is not going to make me jump. I can promise you that much. <sighs> Goodbye, cruel world. The final curtain is calling and there's no time for an encore. Holy fuck! Bear spray? Ah! What the fuck? Holy fuck!
Why on earth did she go in that? Why on earth did she go in that fucking trap door? <sighs> fucking hell. Oh god. Oh wow. I'll spray it again. Didn't do it last time. How did it get over? I mean, this feels like a dumb, dumb decision. eyes or his tongue. Fucking hell. Fuck me. Run bitch run indeed. Fucking hell. Whew. I I don't even know what that is, no. Like I say I'm I'm guessing they're some sort of zombies. Just based off matey boy shooting his own finger off when he got touched or bit by one. Easy. I got it. He's okay. And old this matey boy's got a load of black shit in him from where he's been hacked. You in pain? No, no. Sorry, I'm just. I'm really hungry. We'll get you some food inside, okay? Yeah. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, out man. the wheelbarrow, laddie. I can eat a horse. <laughs> I don't know if we'll be able to find you a horse, but maybe some granola? Oh, like, like werewolves or some shit. That's why he needs to eat. So we're missing a few. This will open the nurse's station. Should be plenty of stuff in there. Well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned up for now. I'll get you something neat. You want to be having a bath or something, mate? Washing the shit out you of that room. You are going to find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yup. We'll come meet you. Copy that. Do you think that whatever attacked them out there is, I don't know, has their scent or something? What? I don't know, like what if it got a taste for blood and now it's gonna track them down? I, I doubt it. I just feel yeah. like if we stick with them, we're sitting ducks, I don't know. I really don't think that whatever attacked them out in the woods is gonna get into the lodge. Okay, yeah. I think it yeah, might. You're, you're probably right. <sighs> just stop Come on, sh let's go call for backup. I've seen enough horror. It's pretty to weird know. to see this place so dead. It's gonna you never find came us. down here at night while camp was in session. What? No, did you? A couple times, yeah. <sighs> Told you. Where are you going? I. I I, I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. I don't think Nick's injuries are as bad as we thought. Really? Really? You don't think that? Well, that's good news. Yeah. So what now? We gotta call for help. Who should I call? 
Ghostbusters. Uh, Mr. H. The only number I got is to this phone. Okay, then ninety one one. You mean nine one one? Who says ninety one one? I don't know. I... Anyway, yeah, but like, what should I ask for? Like, police, ambulance, huh. both. Well, do you need to specifically ask for an ambulance, or can you just say, help, help? So they'll say, 911, what's your emergency? And I'll say, help, help, my friends may have been attacked by bears, but maybe not a bear, but definitely an animal with teeth. And then one of them was kidnapped by these hunter guys with blood on their faces, and there may have been shots fired, but not by us, but also maybe by us. Yeah, go with that. Sounds good. And they cut my friend Jacob down from a tree. Separate incident. Long story. Yeah, yeah, that's that's good. Okay. We're gonna get creepy Sheriff John Terry. What's wrong? Dead. Well, did you hang up? How could I have hung up? I don't know. You know, maybe you slipped and hung up or something. Do you know how phones work? Yeah, of course. Real phones, not cell phones? Do you know how phones work? Okay, well, you broke it. I did not. <sighs> okay, so this phone's a no-go. No one has signal. Is there anywhere else in the camp that has a landline? Well, not a landline. What? The radio hut has some old broadcast gear. Where, where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably. Why do I feel this is going to end in tears? All right, yeah. Let's let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. I will put it back when we're good and safe and help is on the way. Uh, okay, just careful with it. I'll be fine. Okay. Uh, it's it's probably the weather. What weather, Ryan? Maybe, maybe it was the bears. Always bears. the bears. And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay, so for the sake of argument, what if that bear that uh, cut our phone line and just cut out all the power, what if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Yeah, Fair big point. boy Thank pants you. are needed. We should probably tell Caitlin that we're going to the radio hut. They're probably freaks. Yeah, okay, yeah, let's go. Oh my god. Again, the middle yeah, of the night and the lack of jumpers way. is astounding. Tell I'm old and get cold. Do you think she really needs it, though? Uh, she needs it just as much as we do. If she's staying in the lodge, we're going out there. You literally just said there might be something dangerous in the lodge. When? Like 20 seconds ago. Okay, sure, but that's because I really wanted the gun. Just give her the gun, man. Giving the gun feels like a bad idea, but uh, it also right. feels like the right idea. You're right. That doesn't hey, make sense, but it doesn't matter. If you're extra nice to me, I'll, I might let you hold it. Don't write a check that your ass can't cash. My ass has got quite the bank account. Ooh. Am I interrupting something? Chin up, big guy. It, 
I wouldn't really know what to do with it, okay? I trust you. Oh, thank you so much, Dylan. You're so generous and handsome. Yeah, no problem. Don't mention it. Oh, back to being Emma. We're going to have to go on that wire across the top, aren't we? Yep. Yeah, we are. On a scale of one to fucking terribly, how terribly do we think this is going to go? I mean, I can only assume... Oh my word. <laughs> oh God. Oh my God, the tongue, the tongue, the tongue, the tongue, the fucking tongue. Oh God. Oh my God, that tongue. What the fuck? Just got another set of clothes completely drenched. Ruin the taser. Although we never used the taser, so I don't know where we got the bear spray from, like, but possibly that bag we searched to get the clothes. Oh, here's creepy lady. That's chapter four done. Oh, good to see you. Good to see you. Huh. A time again, is it? Yeah, yeah, it is. Strength. <laughs> Strength can be surprising. Knowing one's own raw power, tapping into it, tapping into a previously unknown energy. I suppose there are forces at work within us all. And with one hand it gives, and with the other it could rip away. The magician, <laughs> the incredible, the unbelievable, the mystical, sensational, perceptive manipulation, the work of a magician. Now you see it, now you don't. Blink and you miss it. And you wouldn't want to miss it. As always, there's more to see. And as always, the choice is yours. We always want to would see them all. Would you like to see more? Yes, yes, I would. Yes, I am terrified. Choose one. And I want Choose help. wisely. Oh, fuck, we're going to pick one. A magician. I hope this is helpful. What the f I mean, what what the fuck did, did that even mean? So it's goodbye again. I'll leave you with this. Remember who your friends are. Remember who's looking out for you. Thank you so much for taking the time to uh, watch that video. Hope you really enjoyed it. Check out all my other videos that are just over there. Hit the links. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Appreciate y'all. Peace.